More heat records are expected to fall across the state this week as temperatures soar to 100 degrees or hotter. The National Weather Service office in Boulder issues the weather warnings for these counties in northeast Colorado. Our office has never actually issued a heat advisory or excessive heat warning. Meteorologist Paul Schlotter says they can issue an excessive heat warning if the forecast is 105 degrees or hotter, or a heat advisory if the forecast is at least 100 degrees. Those those temps are in the forecast Tuesday and Wednesday, but the warnings are not just dependent on high temperatures. The problem is the low temperature criteria, which is 75 degrees. Schlotter says the Northeast Plains and the Front Range rarely get morning lows warmer than 75 degrees. In fact, in Denver, it's only happened one time in history, and that was way back in 1881. We're reevaluating what we can do in terms of can we ignore that lower temperature criteria and actually just issue a product based on what we expect are going to be the impacts because we know there are impacts when it's that hot during the day. They do have this new heat risk product that's in the experimental phase. Almost all of the Denver Metro is in the level three risk and Schlotter says that would be worthy of a heat advisory under a new format. He says even with the cool Colorado mornings, heat illnesses are common in heat waves like this, and our official weather warnings should reflect that danger. If you're having a hard time finding shade and drinking enough fluids, you could get in trouble pretty quick. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, 9 News.